Blender can do everything that ZBrush can do, and it's free. Only half of that statement is true. Hey, my name's Al, and I've made many videos on my channel comparing, contrasting different features inside of Blender and ZBrush. Today, we aren't talking about tools or performance. Do I even need to mention high poly counts in Blender or novel thingamajigs? Well, let's talk about another reason for sculpting why you might quit Blender for ZBrush. Okay, so I did a job search on ArtStation and you know, we're looking for character artists. So these are character designers, character artists, concept artists inside of these well-known big companies. Some of them are Rare, Splash Damage, Respawn, Infinity Ward, Scanline, the list goes on and on and on. But every single one of these, the requirements were proficient in ZBrush, proficient in ZBrush, no ZBrush. So I 100% guarantee that somebody paused the video right now. They're currently Googling job postings in Blender. They're going to comment. We'll touch back on the subject in a second. So what does this mean? Do you want to work professionally for a major company? ILM? Pixar? For most disciplines, sculpting included, Blender is not the industry standard. Don't take my word for it. Look it up. So I know this is going to be an overgeneralization, but for the most part, Blender users will tell you. Blender can do everything that ZBrush can do, and it's free. Only half of that statement is true. Now, does this mean if you want to work at Blizzard, you have to drop everything that you're doing right now and go buy ZBrush? Well, no, not necessarily. What this does mean is that if you want to work for most of these major large companies, you will have to learn ZBrush at some point. Now, what you can do is, you know, spend all your time and energy getting good at sculpting in Blender. Just get good, bro. And then before you apply, to learn the ins and outs of ZBrush, things like that, get proficient. I'm not talking about a week before your application, but get proficient with ZBrush and then apply for these major jobs. So back to the Blender users who paused and are currently searching for other job postings uh, listing Blender. Many indie game studios save money by using Blender. Blender for modeling, texturing, sculpting, the works. Many people make a living sculpting miniatures on Patreon and the likes using Blender. You may even be able to find a job at a large company that sculpts using Blender. That is not my point. You can land a job using sculpting in Blender. If you have aspirations to work in some of these large companies, you will need to learn ZBrush at some point. So if you are considering buying ZBrush in 2022, watch this video. 